to advance our development agenda and reduce on our debt burden. However, many voices expressed disapproval of these proposals, leading me to drop the bill and terminate the process. It therefore means that apart from the people of Kenya asking us to consider alternative means of raising revenue, which I agree with, there is general consensus that the country requires to confront and address long-standing priority national issues, including national debt, public expenditure, and anti-corruption measures, so as to release resources for creating opportunities, creating jobs, and creating wealth. <clears throat> As a way of charting the future from the current situation we are facing, I welcome all the leaders here, and I have heard what they have said this morning, and all other stakeholders working together for us to address the current economic situation through a broad-based political arrangement and to rally the country forward, as has been said by the former Prime Minister. And therefore, we have yet another opportunity as a country, Kenya being the resilient people we always are, to come together and figure out the future of our country in a manner that makes sure that we address the existential challenges and threats that face our nation. Uh, and that's the reason why I set up a committee to work and audit our debt for us to interrogate our expenditure and for us to work on anti-corruption. I want to encourage Parliament to expedite the conflict of interest bill that will support our anti-corruption measures, especially in relation to public officers. And I am hopeful that these are some of the conversations that we will be engaged in going forward. I am very confident that, as always, Kenya knows how to pull together, and leaders know how to come together in the best interest, not, on individu not of individuals, not of parties, but the collective body of the Kenyan people. And I look forward to working with leaders, as I have said, going forward on a broad-based political mechanism that will see us steer the country to the future. Thank you very much uh, to all the leaders here, Asante Nisana, to the people of Kenya. I wish you well, and God bless our great country. Asante.